Samsung Odyssey Arc 2022 Review. The Samsung Odyssey Arc is a full-size gaming console. At 55 inches, it's the same size as numerous TVs, and the stunning specs don't prevent it from having a curved display and 4K resolution. The gaming monitor system capitalizes on any player's desire to have an immersive world or appreciate the comfort of staying on the sofa. It's also outfitted with a lot of entertainment attributes in case playing well on TV would be more enjoyable. The 55-inch display, curved design, and 4K resolution render the gaming experience immersive on the Samsung monitor. The monitor includes plenty of hardware and software features that increase versatility as well as great speakers. It's huge and heavy, but some features aren't as good as they sound. The sheer size of the arc tower over its peers is undeniably unreal, especially considering its height of 55 inches. Treat this display as a PC monitor and you will remain straining your neck all. While Samsung suggests sitting at least 80 cm back, at which distance you will still be moving your head. Sit farther from the experience and it's better. So the arc works well if you relax back, lean back with the keyboard or controller, or sit across the room and use a console. Combining Rio's 4K resolution with the 1000R curve will allow you to have a fantastic experience no matter your situation, whatever the distance. The arc's size, resolution, and shape impress, but Samsung also understands that the 55 inches size will not suit everyone. To that end, Samsung has provided substantial software flexibilities for the Arc. If you want to play widescreen game titles or other types of games, for example, you can change the display to a 21 to 9 or 32 to 9 aspect ratio to widen the field of view. If you want, you can reduce the display area and make it move nearer. Where ticket offices are now called ticket offices, you can divide the screen into four quarters and show different information in each zone in swing the display to the side and functioning as cockpit mode, you can make use of three stacked screens. On a single screen, you might have a game, a web browser, TV streams on a second, some smart device, and a mirror, similar to your smartphone screen. YouTube can also be found to be supported. If you would like, you can play games, watch streams, and keep tabs on your conversations all at once. Outside of multi-view mode, there's more rosiness. It is possible to utilize your Samsung Smart TV's Xbox game streaming feature all functions are accessible, and the menu system is excellent and easy to navigate. The user interface is comprehensive and yay, appropriate to read. The Arc provides a sleek design with excellent image quality. Its high contrast of black pixels at around 0.02 nits stands out, making it ideal for dark rooms. Initially, its screen brightness level was around 90 nits, making it excellent for a cinema room, lounge, or darkened bedroom. The contrast ratio of 45,000 to 1 is a great figure and helps the Arc render vivid blacks along with a great deal of vibrancy everywhere else. That's a better result than can be obtained with conventional IPS or VA screens. On the Arc's display, the brightness level was at 302 nits, which offered a contrast ratio of 4,441 to 1, and at its maximum brightness level, the contrast ratio stood at 742 nits, which was 4,637 to 1. Generally, the Arc is a large and loud success in most segments. The large, immersive, and versatile nature of its colors, as well as their deep contrast, look excellent in games. The speakers on it are especially strong, and the Arc does a great job of mixing gaming and television features. If you want big screen gaming or a TV replacement, the Arc is a potent value for price.